He's quite frail, lying on his couch. The light entering the flat is quite soft. But we can hear the buzzing sound of the streets of downtown Paris, although we're on the ninth floor. It's my grandfather, and he's sharing life advice with me. Philippe, au croisement, choisis toujours le chemin le plus difficile, car c'est là que tu apprendras le plus. Which translates into, at the crossroads, choose the most difficult road, because this is where you're going to learn the most. My grandfather was the embodiment of courage. He fled Germany just before the war. He learned French by watching movies over and over again. He started a family and a life in wartime. With the firm belief that tomorrow will be brighter. I wasn't aware at that point that that would be, that would be my last conversation with him. So 25 years later, I am at the crossroads in my own life. And I, too, choose the most difficult road. I moved to Australia with my wife. I don't know anyone here. And I, too, started a family. I created a new life. Creation, what a wonderful word. I love creating. I just can't help myself. I am an industrial designer. Way too often, though, I see industrial design being used as a kind of a beautification of a product, an afterthought, like lipstick on a pig. <laughs> Take a look around you and see all those products designed for the dump. We are surrounded by poor design. Take the USB. How many times you had to turn it to plug it in? How many times you had to turn it twice? <laughs> and how about that packaging that just won't open? <laughs> I see those frustrations. I believe in a purposeful design, a design that is profitable yet elegant, functional, and sustainable, socially responsible and enduring, a design that lasts. Manuel lives in a small village in Portugal. Manuel is a firm believer in purposeful design because he's been using that for the last 10 years and it helped his community and his growing manufacturing company. When I have designed cable stuff, this smart and nifty cable management device, I too had a choice. The easy one was to manufacture in China, but I took the other option. I worked with Manuel in Portugal because I know the positive impact it had in his community. And I know it also reduced pollution by a factor of 10 times and will bring a more profitable business in the long run. Working with Manuel reminded me of my grandfather's wisdom. So now I would like to share it with you. Which road will you choose? Will you take the easy road and buy or produce design for the dump? Or will you stand up and choose purposeful design? <laughs> 